Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another thrilling aviation episode. The airplane, which is currently one of the fastest modes of transportation and has increased passenger demand, is now starting to understand the importance of cargo transport. Airlines are looking for aircraft that can be converted from passenger to cargo flights. We will look at the conversion process in this video. Passenger to freighter conversions allow passenger aircraft to be transformed into freighter aircraft. In order to enable the loading and unloading of goods, the process entails removing the seats and other passenger comforts from the aircraft's cabin and replacing them with a cargo door and other alterations. A well-liked and economical method of producing more cargo airplanes is to convert existing freighters. It's amazing to observe how a passenger plane is transformed into a cargo, especially as airlines continue to acquire more of these jets. Here is a step of the entire process. Number 1. Interior fittings are removed from the aircraft, including the seats, galleys, restrooms, overhead bins, and other interior fittings. Number 2. The installation of cargo handling systems includes the use of cargo nets, roller bed systems, and cargo loading systems. Number 3. The cabin floor has been strengthened so that it can support the weight and loading demands of the cargo. Number 4. Cargo door installation. To make it easier to load and unload cargo, a cargo door is mounted on the fuselage. Number 5. Structural modifications may be required to support the added weight and stress of cargo operations. Number 6. Cargo fire suppression systems and other avionics are installed to support cargo operations. Number 7. To make sure the modified aircraft complies with legal standards and is secure for cargo missions, it goes through rigorous testing and certification processes. Number 8. The P2F conversion process can be performed by specialized aircraft modification companies and can take several months to complete. The cost of the conversion varies depending on the type of aircraft and the extent of modifications required. Depending on the type of aircraft and the amount of changes required the cost of conversion varies. However, by enabling operators to transport cargo, the change can increase the aircraft's useful life and generate additional revenue. Analysts predict that demand will increase in this sector based on the existing market. The modifications will also be advantageous for airlines, leasing firms, maintenance businesses, and aircraft manufacturers. A conversion of an aircraft is technically highly challenging. In order to assure efficient production and on-time completion, it necessitates highly skilled experts and a sizable quantity of parts. Many work steps used to be done manually. But today, even in the aviation sector, an increasing number of MRO, maintenance, repair, and operation activities are being automated. Thanks for watching. Share your thoughts about this video in the comments section.